Hey guys, I'm Tika and welcome back to Twilling ZA. So today's video is about a room tour. The reason why I'm filming alone is because it's my room tour and my sister's gonna do a separated version of hers in her own room. This is currently not my room because my room like the lighting in my room is so bad that I don't have a really reflection or natural lighting from my room because mine is in a closed area. So I chose to film in my friend's room, so this is not my room in the surroundings. But I will show you my room right now as I'm doing a room tour just for you guys. If you guys want to do see any DIYs, I will be saying in the video. Just comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, share it to your friends and your friends' friends. So let's get right to the video. Video. Wow. Let's get right to the video. Much love and support. Bye, guys. This is the door. I just made it. I used a um, building hanger thingy, and then I just put it on top of it with the stick. You can see right there by the corners. Then I just took. Um, a picture from the internet saying exit and yeah i just put it there by the door just wanted to be extra creative by it because it looked so boring then there by the um, light switch i just put recycle i just wanted to be extra i don't know i just wanted to be extra even though i don't know you can't recycle electricity but you can anyway and then this is my ironing board i had nowhere else to put it around my room so i put it here it also still looks pretty you know because the color is yeah whatever we're going to have the side now so this is my wardrobe it's really long so i really like it i don't want to show you inside my wardrobe because it's probably messy, but anyway, let me show you. Um, here are my clothes and the wardrobe. Here are my clothes. My shoes are down there. My bags over there because there's space for my bag. Extra hangers, you know, there's a nice mirror here that you don't want to use the other one. But anyway, I put my luggage bag up there so for space and stuff. So when I go home, and the other one has my shirts and stuff. Yeah, you can see PJs, yada yada yada. All the other stuff like my groceries and stuff and towel, whatever. It looks messy. I'm not gonna show you. So over here, I made a nice DIY pot plants, whatever, decoration stand. Um, if you guys want me to show you how to do it, just comment below. But I used a wooden plant over there as a base, and then I used two strings to put it on top. It's very easy, it's very, very easy, very quick to do. And then on this pot plant stand, whatever, I put sticks here for, as a form of decoration. I didn't want to do it, so I just put them there. Then I put my Zara perfume over here. It really looks pretty by itself, and it's they take and stuff then i made my own diy pot plant with my brother's old um clay pot thing and i just printed out a verse from the bible saying trust in the lord with all your heart by proverbs 3 verse 5 then i used all um, fake plants with real sand and real rocks yes and then i took this nice fragrance um hand lotion because i like the gray and then i took this nice this sea perfume my most favorite perfume in the world as mentioned in the january favorites just go check it out up here in the card and then yeah here this is a nice thing it just brings up the whole room and over here it's a nice laundry poster because i have my laundry basket right here i just put my toiletry bag over there because it's so for me easy for me to get access my stuff and just take it and leave yeah <laughs> Now we're going to the table in the study area. Over here are like all the stuff that, like my books, you know, um, I read a lot of James Patterson books, so yeah. All my textbooks right here, and my books, books, my iPad, my Bible, my camera, beauty box behind, lotion, perfume, my laptop, other books. And over there's like another box for jewelry stuff that I don't use. Okay, that I do use, but I just didn't have any place to put it. My makeup bag, everyday makeup stuff are in there. Wow, learning out. Everyday makeup stuff are in there. And then uh, extra toiletries that I didn't have space to put is over there in that box. Hop your ass in this jacuzzi and bring it to me And then over here on this beautiful, beautiful table Right here is my diary where you put all my notes and stuff I take to school Scissors, you know, the basics, you know, the USB thingy, the essentials Then I DIY'd my lamp, I spray painted with gold spray paint um, I DIY'd those two, um, look like coaster thingies but still look pretty So with marble paper and laminated it and I got this cute frame from my friend for our birthday last year Year, and I just thought that oh my gosh I'm gonna use it because it's black and white so I put um what you call it a picture of my sister and I saying best friends can you see best friends right there anyway then over here it's, just, ugh, it's a cute dare it's very simple you just use pegs and then you clip it onto the pictures and it's just there but I just want to 
add extra room, you know. Then over here uh, by this box thingy, I DIY'd it, I painted it black, but I faded black. I didn't want to make it look black black, so it can look very messy, but it looks cool. Then I DIY'd those tin, what you call it, cans with um, sides and stuff. Let me show you an example. Just roll with it, you see, but I put all my paints here. I don't know why they're finishing, but anyway, but yeah, um, all those pens, cookie thingies and stuff. Then over here is my monthly planner. Now we're on to March. Yes, so this is my monthly. I haven't written anything here because I don't really like study on my table. I study on my bed. So yeah. Then yes, and then I just chose this magazine right here because it looks really pretty. It goes with the whole aesthetics around the table. So yes, I put that there. And I chose that tissue box um because it looks really nice. It goes with the grey aesthetic and stuff. I did this DIY marble um what you call a notice board. Um it's very easy if you want me to do it. Just comment below, like I said. I spray painted these, um, needles. you know what I'm talking about. These gold needle thingies. Ugh, I don't, I, my, I'm not using my word today. I spray painted them and I just printed out these, um, saying looking good, Camilla. That is my Instagram name. Right now, we're going to my bed. This is how it looks like. Very cute. There is my mat. Like I said, I'm trying to go with the gray aesthetic. Um, over there are my plaids and stuff, so matte gray mats. I tried to get like a gray um, mattress, but mom couldn't find, so it's fine. So, yes, my mom gave me this one. It's very cute. Oh, I used to love pink, so that's why the pink is there. And pink pillows and stuff, and cute. So this is my wall design. I printed out a lot of pictures. My I'm a huge, huge fan of Lana Del Rey. So she's over there. Two pictures of her. Then I just took a picture over there. We're saying looking good, Camelo. And over there, fashion and like a lot of fashion and stocks and stuff. Then I chose. I like literally took my time cutting out these triangles and putting it on the wall. Even though it took forever, but at the end of the day, it executed very well. And then I chose these pictures. Like I said, it was like exactly the picture here, but I just put three here. So that's how it looks like. All these posters and stuff. But anyway, bring my bed and all. Go to the door. The room is small, but I like how small it is. And here's the window. Yeah, everything is chill. So that is the end of my video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment below if you want me to do a DIY. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.